Take a big step back and literally fuck your own face! What's up, guys? CS Joe, and uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to uh, install and patch Diablo 2 so you can play uh, on the private server that I play on. So you can play with me and be featured in a video if you would like. Um, so first, what you're, wanting, what you're gonna want to do is go to the Pirate Bay link in the description, download uh, this uh, Diablo 2 <clears throat> with Lord of Destruction pre-patched file, and basically what it'll look like when you download it is it'll look like the program's directory already so like it's like you've already installed it so basically what you want to do is back out of it so you're just at the Diablo 2 folder open up your um, local disk go into program files put this in program files even if you're on a 64 64-bit operating system and you have the x86 folder just put it in program files anyway because it'll run better just trust me and you drag Diablo 2 in there as you can see I've already done that so I'm not gonna do it again it'll take a little while maybe about 15 minutes maybe less not I don't really remember how long cuz I just went AFK while I was doing it but anyways so then you'll have all this then what you wanna do is download the other two files I have linked in the description it'll be BNET Gateway Editor and WOB 11313 I was kinda of funky 11313 anyways Open up the WOB11313 and then take this patch and drag it into here. It'll ask you to replace, just replace the file and destination. <clears throat> and then, um, then you can close out of that. And then, BNET Gateway Editor, open that up, go to Diablo 2 down here at the bottom tab. Uh, I'm just going to delete this so I can show you again. All right, so you'll just have these four. Click Add Gateway. Put the name as uh, WOB Gaming. It doesn't have to be that, but it can be whatever you want. I just put it as that to remember. Uh, zone is zero. IP is going to be bnet. Dot WOB Gaming. Dot net. And then if uh, if it go ahead and do Detect Gateway when you have that highlighted, and it should say this attempt to connect gaming bnet wobgaming.net connected time 94 milliseconds well I mean it doesn't have to say 94 milliseconds it can be whatever it says but just as long as it says connected then it'll, it, it's working if not you might have typed something in wrong this should be what it says uh, but also if you have typed it in right and you're sure you've typed all this in right and when you press the tech gateway it says it doesn't say connected then the server might be down I've experienced that a couple of times but it should only be down for about 10 or 15 minutes in my in my uh, in my experience so yeah just come back a little later and try again um, I'll be posting on my announcements page on my YouTube channel whenever I do start playing Diablo 2 and um, so I'm going to go ahead and launch the game to, just to show you how you join a game. Alright, so you'll be here. Uh, choose Gateway and choose WOB Gaming or whatever you named yours to. Click Battle.net. Might need to turn that down a bit. Seems kind of loud. Alright. Now, um... Once you've gone to here, navigated here, the Battle.net page, it'll say uh, you can use an existing Battle.net account. Don't do that. Obviously, you probably don't have a Battle.net account if you are um, pirating the game. But anyway, click Create New Account. Read all these rules. Seriously, read them because some of these are different than uh, other private server rules. Um, and just, just read them. It's not that long. And go ahead and agree. Type in whatever you want your account name to be. Password, password, and then click OK. 
I'm gonna go ahead and log into mine since I've already made mine. And then uh, you can create a new character. Um, so y you can choose any of these because expansion characters do work. I'm just gonna make Yolo Swag. Oh man, already exists. That sucks. That sucks. All right. And then once you have your character, you just click uh, join, and then see that this 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 guy's already created a game, so you can join him. But I'm gonna be creating my own game for when I play. It's gonna be called CS Joe's Game. If there is a password, it's gonna be YOLO. But there's probably not gonna be a password. And uh, I'm cool. That's the description. Max number of players is eight. Whenever you're setting up a game. As you can see. So yeah, and you press create game and it'll launch you into a game. Seven other people can join you. And yeah, that's how that's how you play it. I'll be posting, like I said, I'll be posting on my announcements page whenever I'm gonna be playing. So you can come play with me if you want. Most likely you're not gonna be watching this video unless I linked it to you to tell you how to uh, install the game just so you're not confused. But if you do want to play with me, then you can follow all these instructions and uh, be featured in a video so yeah that's about it guys uh, thanks for watching and have a good day